Hello everyone, my name is Raven and welcome to Raven67854 Gaming and welcome to another amazing Left 4 Dead 2 tutorial. So today we're actually going to look at infected ladders and how to make them. A little bit of a side detour for things. And it's actually quite simple. So the first thing we need to do is we actually need to define, you know, where's the ladder going to be? So we're going to select our entity or shift D. And we're going to type prop underscore static. And then we're just going to place it down and open it up. And like we've done many times before, we're going to look for a uh, pipe. Because, you know, in Left 4 Dead, uh, well, you know, they tend to climb up pipes and stuff like that. And I'm going to use the gutter pipe 256.mdl. I believe this is the one that I want to use. And I'll just hit apply. And then I'll raise it on up. Okay. You know what? This is actually perfect. Okay. And whoop, wrong window there. And I'll just put it right about here. And then I'll go to properties. And then for the pitch, yaw, and roll, I will change the yaw to 180. And then we'll just move it back. Okay. So we have our pipe. So our infected can walk up and go this way. And while not the most ideal, they can do it. Because remember, this player clip only stops players. It does not stop infected. Now, the other thing that we're going to do is we're going to make a brush. And we're going to do a no draw. And we're just going to draw it around the pipe. And it just so happens that it's a pretty good fit. I'm actually going to widen it just a little bit and pull it in so that it's a little more flush with the pipe itself. And we'll hit enter. And then I will go back to our texture application and select the front uh, face. And we're going to type in tools. And OK, so we have three different ones here. We have climb, climb alpha. Honestly, from what I can tell in the descriptions of, you know, on the wiki, alpha is just climb, but different. In other words, they're exactly the same. They just look different in the editor. We're going to use the versus one. So the versus one works uh, naturally for versus. So NPC players can use it as well, uh, regular infected. So we'll just hit apply. And as you can see, we have a nice little green up arrow. Now, the other thing we want to do is we want to select the brush, the whole brush, and go to Tools, and then Tie to Entity. And we want to turn it into a Funk Ladder. And I believe this is actually something I forgot to do, whoops, in my uh, ladder tutorial. So if you um, just select the ladder, Tie to Entity, huh, well, uh, I'll just hit no there. And then we will just change this to a funk ladder and then hit apply. Okay. So um, you just need to tell the engine that it is a ladder. And this is, you know, it's it's later on, like when you create, like when it builds, um, you know, the BSP and all the other stuff and it builds in navigation, it takes into account, you know, the names of what these uh, brushes are. And it's just a good idea. I mean, obviously, of course, it functioned fine before. And in fact, it would have functioned fine uh, even if we had nav meshes. Like, the players would have went up and down. It, it would have been perfectly fine. Um, but it's proper to set it this way, especially, like, later on when we build the nav meshes, it'll automatically or, quote-unquote, should automatically, uh, you know, create the connecting points for this. But if not, you know, we'll go through and we'll do it. So we can't test this right now, but it's ready for us to use later. And when we get to nav meshes, we'll actually set this. And then when we start testing, uh, we'll be able to see that the infected can climb up it and go over. Uh, and if you wanted to, you can even put like another one right here. You can put them anywhere. I mean, this is very much a, um, a test level, you know, if you will. And all it really 
you know, functions as it's just a prototype of, you know, all the features. It's up to you guys to go make something really cool. So this was a really short tutorial. Uh, thanks everybody for, you know, tuning in. And once again, thank you guys so much. I believe this is episode or tutorial number 17. I can't believe I made it to 17 of them. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe and hit that bell. And if you'd like to support this channel, do become a member. You can hit the join button below, or you can also, um, you know, uh, there's a link to it in the description. I don't know why my brain died there for a second, but it did. I apologize. As well as, you know, if you have any comments or issues or anything like that, do join the Discord. We're growing every day. We get about one or two new people as the time of this video every day. And it's really super nice to see you guys there. You guys have a good one, and I'll see you guys in the next one.